everyone. Uh, Greg Matheson, Chief Operating Officer with Newfound Gold, and we're uh, taking a look at one of the latest intersections of the Keat Zone and the deepest intersection we've recorded to date at the Keat Zone, the drill hole NFGC 21182. Uh, rather uh, spectacular looking intercept in the step out drilling that we're conducting at the Keat Zone. This drill hole has reported upwards of 600 visible gold grains across 30 meters width. And uh, we're going to take a little closer look at the, the drill core and have an examination of the geology here. If we look at the overall length of the hole, you can see there's a rather massive quartz flooding throughout this zone and a rather continuous length of mineralization here at the Keat. Everywhere where we see flags identified here are sections of drill core that contain visible gold mineralization. If we look at one of the pieces here, you can see all of the green circles are representing visible gold grains. And we have gold throughout the drill core. This is the deepest intersection yet to date at the Keat zone and we're very excited about the prospects for, for additional step out drilling here at this zone. But the other thing to note here are the vugs that we often get, these open cavities in the quartz veins. And uh, this is one of the characteristics that we often associate with an epizonal style of mineralization. Mineralization at the Keat zone is associated with a secondary fault structure to the larger regional Appleton fault. And we, we understand that because of the uh, numerous fault gouge zones that exist within the Keats. And we can see one of those right here. So in addition to the main intersection into the Keats main zone at uh, Joel NFGC 21182, we see a uh, bonus secondary zone and a relatively significant um, intersection here into the foot wall of the heat structure. We're seeing a fairly broad quartz flooded zone across roughly 10 to 12 meters. In this case, we, we see a very high sulfide content, uh, lesser amounts of, of visible gold, although we have noted a few specks of uh, fine grain visible gold. As always, um, please make sure to visit the company's CEDAR site for our full corporate disclosure and uh, visit the company's website at www.newfoundgold.ca for additional updates as we move forward with the exciting exploration here at the Keats Center.